Hey y'all, we made it to Cosmo, Mexico. Um, we're about to go out. We have an excursion. I don't even know if y'all can see all these people down here. That's about to be us in a few seconds. Okay, so we're doing a Mayan tour, eating, and tasting. I think chocolate and vodka or tequila tasting. So once we get there, I'll show you guys. No water today. I actually got sunburned. So. Oh, this is so much fun. Okay, I'll see you guys when we get out there. Just two lines, please. I am going to count everybody, so make the line. Also, of our local, so to visit on Sundays. Why on Sundays? Because it's when usually we have not cruise ship arrivals. So we bring our cooler, our uh, our blanket uh, to lay down and just uh, receive the, the light of the sun. We bring ceviche, drinks. Uh, this is a bank of sand. That's why we have those beautiful colors. The name from this city, San Gervasio. Friends, but that is not the original name. Now is the official name. Friends, and where the name from? Come from. Familia, and like I lose say on the bus, my friends, the island is abandoned very years ago. In 1841, 21 families from mainland, people back to start living to the island. And the families sharing all the island. So, 
Humility is not his best thing. Mm -hmm. Calling can be very Oh, no. 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 When somebody asks, hey, how are you? You can ask, you can answer, malo, and they go, ah, he's good. Really, malo, it's like, a, I'm good. Malo, he means, well, they, the next thing is for I say, tush kabin. Tush kabin, what, what are you doing? Tush kabin means, what are you doing? Kosh, pana, wene. I didn't know somebody was behind me. <laughs> no, 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 not at all. Right? Yeah. <laughs> this is piña colada and Mexican vanilla. Okay. Piña colada. Three for twenty-one. Good. Twenty-one. Uh huh. Three for twenty-one. <laughs> I wish. Name is Gaspar. I'm gonna be your instructor about these tequilas. I'm gonna teach you the right way to enjoy it. How to recognize real tequila to commercial tequila. Commercial tequila is everywhere. If you're going to the moon, you're gonna see a guy drinking tequila there. <laughs> Look, this is the traditional tequila. This is the original. I'm talking about the color. See? For to make a bottle like this, tequila, we're gonna need agave azul. Agave azul is growing in Jalisco State. Jalisco has a perfect soil, perfect elevation. Jalisco is about 12 feet to 2,000 meters above the sea level. The weather condition is completely different to this island has. Jalisco has clay and volcanic soil. The minerals are very rich there. That's why in Jalisco the agave is growing about 2 or 3 meters tall. But to make a bottle of tequila, we're gonna need the bottom part, the trunk. That's why you're gonna need a help, Kimador. Have you heard about that name, Kimador? See, the tequila producers, they make... Every time you smell the tequila, guys, you're gonna smell the aroma. Tequila is a wonderful drink to have some many aromas. After you smell it twice, you're gonna drink a tequila like a water, as a water, you're gonna swallow it. As soon as the tequila goes inside, you're gonna inhale the air to your nose deeply and exhale out to your mouth slowly. <laughs> okay, so, quick smell, smell. Take it back. Drink it. Swallow it. Swallow it. Okay, y'all, cheers. cheers. Ready? Oh. <laughs> now, inhale and exhale out. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, that's good. I don't feel wow. anymore. That's, that's good. good. That's, that's good. good. <laughs> Lots of power on the bus, right? 
So we need to go down to push the bus. Nah, just kidding. We are going to switch. We are, the, we are going to switch the transportation. So uh, we are pretty close to the pier actually. But uh, however, to, to do it uh, faster, we are going to switch the transportation. change buses y'all this, this is funny hmm. it's been an adventure here today this is our last stop so maybe not the tequila ah is the bus driver didn't have tequila mm. i wish i could tie you up in my shoes make you feel i'm pretty too i was told i was beautiful but what does that mean to you look into the mirror who's inside there the one with the long hair same on me again today <laughs> Hey y'all, it is the last day of the cruise <laughs> and I don't think I vlogged, I, oops, I vlogged a lot but I don't think I talked to y'all enough on the camera so I'm talking to y'all now. <laughs> um, this cruise has been absolutely fun, 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 fun. Explains why I have not been recording or talking to y'all much. Um, I might have to do some voiceover commentary for y'all because we were just having fun, like I said. When you go on vacation, it's to have fun and just relax, and that is what we did. So forgetting to record myself talking to y'all, forgetting to record certain things is, it happens, it happens. It's the last day of the cruise, so um, we'll see what we get into today. <laughs> That I got the lowest process called vacuum freezing. That's what they all the air and at the degree is sucked. Our obligation is giving a clear appearance. You see why?
that you cannot buy Send me a love that you cannot mix One is the joy that you cannot waste And the other one price that you cannot fix This is the peace that you cannot buy Finding a way where you cannot see Man with this system, he cannot pray I need to find relief But behind my mind Like, look, let me move out of the way. Yeah. I ain't trying to get caught up in this. Okay, y'all. So there was this fight. Um, we really do not know what exactly happened. I think it was apparently over some shoes that someone stole, but apparently um, some other things or some other items were being stole throughout the cruise. And um, this fight broke out. This one lady um, spit on a girl, and it was just a whole bunch of chaos, y'all. But I just wanted to come and do this voiceover really quick because I did not do a very good job of vlogging on this last day of this cruise. Um, so while y'all watching this, let me just talk to y'all really quick. If you guys have any questions, any comments that you would like to ask me or just say about cruising, uh, let me know in the comment section. I might do a separate video of um, discussing anything cruise related. Um, I've been on a few cruises. I am now gold status on Carnival, so I don't know if I could be of any help to anyone. Um, on this last day, we went to brunch, and then we pretty much chilled on the deck and just um, relaxed because there really, really wasn't any much of a pool or a jacuzzi open for us to go to. And then um, after that, we went on the ropes course. Um, we saw the ice sculpture. And then we had dinner. After dinner, we all went back to our rooms and freshened up. Um, and then we went to the comedy club to watch a comedy show with CJ. And then we went to the alchemy bar where we always met up each and every night. And then um, after that, we went to the club for a little bit and then we all said our goodbyes. Um, we met two people on this cruise. They were solo cruisers um, and it was really nice, y'all. We had a really great time with them. We do hope to go on a group cruise with them, so hopefully we can make that happen. So stay tuned for that, and I hope you guys enjoy this travel vlog. Hey y'all, cruise is over. Oh my gosh. So much fun, so much fun, so much fun. Um, yeah, we're back in Miami. Shop the see. And that's it, y'all. About to be getting off this boat in um, a few minutes. And then I have to look at my car and then we're gonna drive home. So, hope you guys like this vlog. I know I didn't talk as much as I would like to, but you still get to experience it with me. And hopefully the next trip I do better, okay? Ciao for now. When it's time to leave my life, then it tries to.